up everyone, and welcome back to the North for another episode of Crusader Kings 3 Royal Court. So literally as the video ended last time, I got a ping saying, Ah, we're off on a crusade to Syria soon, do you want to come along? And I was like, hell yeah I do, Deus Vult and all that. Funnily enough, we, it's only us who have joined at the moment, it's just me and the Pope off on a holy war to Syria. Although I could like re-put like put wherever I want. To so be like, oh, actually, we should go do the Holy War over here instead, or Crusade even. But no, it sounds like we're going to Syria, so eh, that's happening in about a year's time. I've now got a claim on Vestaland, which is where Reykjavik lives. He has no friends, and he does have not a lot of strength, but he has almost a thousand gold, so he probably will hire a billion mercenaries. But he is in poor health, so there's a good chance he might die soon. So I pinned him as a character for the time being, I'm going to keep an eye on him. And after the Holy War Crusade is over, if he's dead and his son's taken over, he's going to be in a lot worse condition to survive against us, so we could then take that. So that's the game plan. Wait for the Crusade to happen. Oh, Grand is now level 6. Fan Dabby Dozy. What's our... In terms of... Uh, ooh, and I got glory. Oh man, I'm illustrious. How long to exalt him on then? <laughs> 5,000. Woo! And then Paragon of Virtue is quite a way away. Renown's not doing bad. We're almost at, we're almost insignificant. Uh, I don't know when until the next Dynasty Legacy. About halfway. That's not awful, I suppose. How old are we? We're 46. We're feeling fine. Our son, Elliot, is currently living in Croatia during a civil war, so hopefully he doesn't die. His wife is looking pretty banged up. But she's fine, apparently. So yeah, we'll wait for the Crusade to happen, we'll go pop off on that, and then hopefully when that's resolved, this guy's popped his clogs and we can go take part of Eastland. Wouldn't that be Neesland? Ugh, no, terrible. Anyway. And then we'll probably create some duchies because we're making an absolute buck every time. Although I imagine when I raise my armies to go and fight in the Holy Crusades, that's going to go down quite significantly. But we'll see. Right. Where do we rank in terms of like the best the best we're third so only the byzantine empire and the holy roman empire has a better royal court than us it's pretty cool I'm not gonna lie what can i do here that will make it even better 0.8 it will cost 0.2 i can live with that feast activities we haven't really been doing feast activities guest recruitment cost minus 30 guests will stay longer i'm gonna go decent fat i'm gonna go stylish fashion I wish it would update here so you could actually, you know, the fashion changes as it were, but it, it don't. It don't. Shame. Shame. Okay, anyway. Let's crack on, hopefully. When's it starting? 14th of October next year. Tall Gills heed my summons has arrived at court, my guest. Oh yeah, we've got some knights coming. Well, probably I'm going to hire because one, we've only got 9 out of 16, and two, thanks to some artifacts, we get piety for every knight we have. Pretty handy, isn't it? But everyone's... Oh God, 95. But 28 and 26 is pretty great. 15 is pretty good. How much do you want? Done. We need as many men as possible. Because I think we're the only... Ah, here we go. Here we go. So, what's the damage? 39,000 versus 28,000. It's gonna be a slog fest. You're still alive. How are you doing in terms of health? Poor. All right. Can I permanently kill him? <laughs> Be like, oh, you're poor. Let's make it worse. Uh, I mean, it's higher than I thought. Higher than I thought. I guess I can't just hurt his feelings, can I? He would gain stress. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to send him a poem and hopefully it makes him gain stress. <laughs> Evil. Oh great, the peasants are rising up. I kind of forgot about those guys. So who is it? Oh, Dublin. Oh, fine. No. Rival troops. Let me go deal with these idiots. 849, is it? That's cute. Probably a poor move on my behalf there, but hey. There we go. Why am I commanding it? You finish raising here. I don't know why I was commanding it, but fine. 
There we go. Resolved. How silly that would have been. Wow, this guy has got 32. Maybe I could hire him. Oh, you silly boys. Oh, God, yeah. Minus 1.6. Minus 1.6 isn't as bad as I thought. Get in the bin, please. Stand. Go. Not a problem. Yeah. Yeah, I am going to work on that. Don't worry. I am I am in the middle of fixing that. And, you know, making it better. Give them fields to live on and stuff. It could be much worse. Yeah, I know about the country control. I do have no beneficiary, but I don't have one anyway, so... Eh? Oh, well. I know, I know, I know. But what's everyone doing on the council right now? You're organizing the army. Let's increase... Oh, God, that's not looking great over there either. Dublin. You've only got 15 months before you have finally promoted the culture in Gifmarshen, which is down here. And then you can go over to Dublin and do the same thing. Is there anything I can build? Yes, but I don't have the money for it right now. So I'll wait a minute. Am I going to have enough money to put? No, I mean, the crusade's about to kick off any time now. So I probably shouldn't. Let me go talk to this guy in my jail, eh? So, minus 70. I mean, you are pretty angry, aren't you? Could just execute you. Ooh, and I would lose 33 stress. What stress do I have? 26. Oh, I might save you for a rainy day. Yeah, I'm going to save you for a rainy day. Several fools in one coat. Oh, that's the thing where the cats are coming out, right? I don't like them anymore because I'm sadistic. All right. Well, I've lost 33 stress, so I don't need that anymore. Come on, buddy. You should be pretty upset, right? You should feel pretty poor, right? And also, you're a poet, so you understand when a good po poem is a good poem. So, you must be really angry at me. Oh, 30 days. Here we go. Four, three, two, one, go! Go! War time! The time has come to bring St. George's Holy Wrath against the vile infidels of Syria. Inflamed by righteous fury, the great army of crusades assembled by Pope Alexander set forth. Deus Vault! Okay, now that the music's died down a bit, because my ears are bleeding from how glorious that was. 44,000 versus 37,000. It's going to be pretty close. And I've decided that I'm going to lead it. Just because I look pretty baller in this outfit. I'm losing four a turn now, which is not great. So, where are we going? What the hell? Yeah, okay, it's down there. But I don't want to be the person who first steps out in there, you know? What's everyone else up to? Maybe I should just go to the Papacy and see where they're going, eh? Let's go there. But yeah, that's a long... There's definitely um, a river, because I remember going down it. River... River here? Hang on. Yeah, so if I go there... Then jump off. <laughs> jump off in the Byzantine Empire, and I'm basically there, right? But yeah. How long's that going to take? Six months? This is going to be an expensive war for me. Hope I don't bankrupt myself. Just for the sake of... Oh god, there goes all the money. Mr. Pope, could you bankroll me, please? Why not? No. I'm going to... I'm doing a holy war for you. I guess I'll try and sway him whilst I'm at it. Hey, buddy. 20%. Ooh, that's going to go well, isn't it? I think I'm going to run out of money before I even get there. Where are my men? How have I lost my men? There they are. <laughs> Bloody hell. I actually saved up even more money. Jesus Christ, I'm on 100. Right. We're here. Oh, my God. Get in there. Hopefully, some of you all will die, and then it'll be cheaper, I guess. Kind of a sad way of looking at it, but hey. Bastard, you get. Oh my god, it's 10,000 men there. 
Where are the rest of the good guys? Down here? All oh, right, okay. I guess we should head down there. We're gonna lose a lot of people in the process, aren't we? Yeah, we really are, bloody hell. On the plus side, it does mean Oh nice! I've got a I've got Crusader. Marshal plus two, prowess plus three, and clergy opinion plus fifteen. Woohoo! That's why I sent myself. Oh nice. Twenty-one marshal and twenty prowess. Does that mean he likes me more now? Please? Please like me, Mr. Pope. Minus twenty-three. Can I have some gold now? No. It's never enough, is it, for you? It's never enough, is it? God damn you. Okay, come on, quick as you can. Okay, due to loads of people dying, I've actually got... Oh, God. Hold on a sec, there's a lot of them. Meh, clear rationality. Where are all the... Where are all our guys? Where is everyone? I didn't even mean to siege this, but I guess I'm doing it. Keep him busy, I've got this, maybe. Oh, excellent. Oh, hello, we're gonna lose, aren't we? Decisively? You can do it! Oh my god, their men at arms are rinsing us. Yeah, we're, we're, we might be uh, exiting this crusade quicker than I thought. As long as I don't die. Sivard's been maimed. Not ideal. Who died? My Chancellor died. I thought he wasn't even that old, but yeah, he was older than I thought. Okay, well, that's, he's dead. On the plus side, that means I can make Egil a bit happier. And I'm pretty sure he's a better Chancellor, so, okay. That works. Like, yeah, okay, Syria's got a lot of men. Where are all the... Where's the backup for us? What happened to uh, all our guys? Did we just get rinsed? Oh, God. Where are we retreating to? I wonder. There they are! Right, well, we'll join, no, we'll join up with those guys in a sec. Where are we going? Where are you guys going? Okay, get in the sea, in a good way this time. Time's gonna join them. Guys, can you make a decision as to where you're going? What are you doing, you mad bastards? I was just there! Oh my god. Alright, going back. Bloody hell. Okay, we're in. And we're with everyone this time. So if we lose, we lose together. Everyone needs to stick together, though. Ah, oh, Fiddlebottom has come of age. And she is Intricate Web Weaver, which is actually a lot better than I thought she was going to turn out to be, to be honest. What's going on there? Well, whatever. This is a mess. A bloody mess. Guys, can you all just stay together? Why are you leaving the country now? There's more of you than there is of them at the moment. It's so confusing. So confusing. <laughs> can I not just put a war target down and we just go and deal with it? No? Why are you guys still there? Whatever, man. Do it. Oh, God. Safe space. Get to my safe space. Oh, here we go. Here comes the big wall. Oh, man. Oh, man. You can go either way. Nope, there's more of them. They just keep popping out of nowhere. Oh, wow. No, nope, we're done. Chase it! Who died? Not that first. 
Wow. This whole... Pope Alexander, you did not do a great job of conveying where we should have met. If you were, like, the social events manager in modern times, you'd be very bad. You would have been fired at your job. Sorry to tell you. Where was, where was this? 7,000 men. Jesus Christ, man. Uh, guess I'll go fight somewhere else. Silly buggers. Ow! I'm over here. What are you up to whilst I'm away? Also, please don't be a son. We've done pretty well just having one son. And then daughters. So please be a daughter again. Just so I can mire her off. As not nice as that sounds. But apparently I need the uh, help. He's not dead. He's just sad. He's about to win the war anyway. So we're about to go home. I contributed. What happens if we lose a holy war? Does all the contributions just go in the sea? Like... Yeah, we've lost. Well, that was, uh... That happened. <laughs> I'm sure it was a good book. Right? Those are making money again. Hope, mate, buddy, pal, we've lost. Wow. Wow. So be it. The warriors of St. George found only death and humiliation at the gates of Syria. The crusades were eagerly called and supported by the Pope, and in a disastrous defeat, but only hurt the cause of the faithful. This was surely emboldened more blasphemers and infidels to further stray from Catholicism. Go on, lads. It's over. Syria kicked the shit out of us. On the plus side, I did get the Crusader. Yeah, Crusader tray. Very cool. It means he likes me more. Encourage my slight dip into my more. Now I just keep pretending I know anything about scholarship. Right, so he actually quite, he likes me quite a bit, right? He should also like me because I just went to war for him, right? Right. Uh, yeah? Crusader plus 15. Minus 48. Okay, fine. I also have sinful traits, which, to be fair to him, I really do have sinful traits, so there is that. Okay, well, that went... Well, it happened. It happened. We're still making money, at least, and, you know, it wasn't technically my war I lost, so I'm not actually all that fussed. What do you want, Egil? My counselor has excelled during our recent battles, and I caught his buzzing with excitement. Yeah? He's my chancellor, vassal, and knight. With all the praise raining down, it made clear I'm expected to officially reward him in some manner. I will speak well of him. He is the new lord of the county of Lubeck. That's not how that works. He'll be gifted gold for his accomplishment. Uh, that's like, what, 10 months of gold? Yeah, here you go. Level 7? Level 7. Now we're second. Our court... Oh, wow. I mean, the HRE's court is kind of shit. Don't tell them I said that, though. Please don't. They'll kill me. And my family. Right. Now that's over, I'm going to wait for some money to build up. And I'm going to upgrade this a bit, because I know I'm getting on a bit in age. Although I'm still having kids, apparently, it seems. Please be a daughter. Please be a daughter. We'll find out by the end of the year, I guess. Do not be a son. Also, oh wow, you've gone from having no kids to having two kids. Alright, so you've got Gida Elliot's daughter, Norman. Level of splendor. Ah, oh, cool, we're insignificant. Love being insignificant. And we've got Ivor Elliot's and Norman, who's got quick. Alright, cool. A claim on the county of Paganesia. Hmm. Okay. I'm surprised they didn't get passed down to her children. Might do after she dies. Okay, well, good. Your your 4.0 is pretty decent. Seven living members, King Ivor, one king, one duke, two counts. Yeah, that's all right. We might actually hit the next part of this pretty soon. What are we on? So we need another 300, so we get four a month, so we get about 50 a year. So that's, what, seven years? Yeah. Like 11.05? I could do it. If I'm still alive. What am I, 47? 49.50? I might make it. 
and I'm still the head of culture. I am the cult of personality, baby. And I only need 11 months to discover communal government, so that'll make our development a little bit better as well. Yeah, she quite likes me now. Oh, minus three. What if I gift him something? No, I don't need to. He'll come around. Let's just hold court. Level seven. Knight effectiveness, bestow royal favor, manager of guards, powerful vassal counselor. We're number one. Right, let's hold court. Time to go. One of my guards approached me with my guest Dorota. Dorota? Dorota. Z Pomorza. In chains. Ooh. I caught Dorota here in the process of sending sensitive information to foreign spies in Gwynedd. Oh, Wales, is it? What should we do with her? Off with her head. It's considered to either hostile evil without being viewed as a tyrant. He's killed. Oh man, that'd be very. Whew. I mean, yeah, yeah, I guess. I have, as I, oh, I'm just gonna put her in jail, to jail, straight to jail. Oh, magnificent King Ivor, I am. Wait, she's the one I just put in jail. Who let her out? <laughs> My brother, Duke Swivor, currently sits on the throne of Pomerania. You mean that place that kicked the shit out of us last time? Yes. If you've me impressing my claims, I shall swear fealty. I'm not going to worry them again. She's in jail. Is she still in jail? My daughter, Fiddlebottom, comes to me, asking me to annul her betrothal to Garad, the son of Count Arthur of Lyon. He is a bad match, she is always so foolhardy, and he's unpleasant to boot. Please free me from this obligation. Oh, this is new. I understand you have three. An agreement is an agreement. Then you'll never marry. She gains a mo she becomes a monk. Holy shit, that's pretty brutal. Oh wow. Oh wow. No, no, you have three of them. I assume that means that not everyone hates me for breaking the patrol because she's asked for it. But now I'm gonna marry her to someone else. That's what she doesn't know. So, let's see who's in the market for my daughter, who is now three. Yeah, I don't care about. It was only a count, anyway. Okay, daughter, let's have a look at you. Well, you've actually a lot better in terms of a, an education trait, I thought. You are stupid, though. Which is, you know. Ooh, Sweden. How many men? Six thousands? Are you the first in line? No. No, you're not. So once the king dies, and he's poor, I'm probably going to lose that. Because then he'll just be the brother of the of the king, which I don't know if he'll really do as much. So I've got a feeling that's kind of not worth it. How old are you? 54. You ill? You're poor. Frozen grief. Jesus. Alright, he's very unhappy. Poland? Are you the first in? Oh my god, you are not the first in line. By far. Let's go, Messiah. Screw it. I'm gonna make all the kids of Messiah stupid through the inherited traits. <laughs> uh, that'd be that'd be one way to take England. Be like, all right, well, I'm gonna take it from the inside by poisoning their genetics. <laughs> I am seven steps ahead. I'm playing 5D chess, baby. Okay, great. Well, cool. I should have a lot of friends, right? Yes, I do. I've got about 10,000. God, Iceland's so rich. It's so rich. My lord. Oh, no! It's a sun! Alright, going to Torfin, why not? Technically, Elliot's going to take the Kingdom of Denmark as a whole. So, he'll still be in charge. But he won't have, like, all the domains. And he's got a really good stewardship, so he deserves all the names. Fine, you know, whatever, fine. Uh, fine, done. Done. He was born yesterday, but give me an alliance now, please. A game of riddles. 57%, 39%. I don't really want to imprison Glum. He's, he's nice enough. <laughs> Sorry, I've got shit to do. 
Oh, he bested me. Oh, well. Hello. Okay, so now I've got a lot of allies, right? So if I attacked here, I've got 16,000 guys. He does also have 1,000 gold, though. And I'm pretty sure in terms of mercenaries, for 1,000 gold, he could pay for, you know, a solid 4,000 men. There still wouldn't be enough. Who's fighting? Mercia. Who are you fighting against? England. Oh. Okay. Sure. Oh, it's like a weird line. All right. Inspired person can be sponsored. Hello, where, where's the inspired person? I would like to. Sp I would like to speak to them. Salmon Grand, a weave inspiration. His skill is merely decent. I mean, I've had much worse. Make me a weave or a cape. Oh, cape! A cape I could pass down to my son would be great. Right. Anyway, this is like it's about to be a mess, right? I say plus sixty-four though. I'll raise my men at arms, because that way I'm not blowing money, and I'm still technically helping them. Mia Nup Nupa, the Brave, Forder, Holy Warrior. This is the guy that I uh, helped in the uh, when he was like, oh, I should give him a trait or something, and I called him the Brave. So let's hope he does a good job. And I still get a bit of money even after raising these guys, right? Come on, race faster. Wow, I don't have a lot of men at arms, do I? Well, I'm helping. They have a lot of men. We got a lot of men. Go down there. Cause a cause a fuss, but don't go too crazy. Oh, Harold's dead. On the plus side, that means I can. Oh wow, thirty-one. Thirty-one. Done. That's insane. I don't care about my uh, people not liking me. I'm not saying no to thirty-one marshal. Holy hell. Well, we've actually got enough men to uh, attack. That's surprising. Are these good guys or bad guys? Neutral army. All right, fine. All the bad guys are over there, and I'll have to get through them first, right? Yes. Saying that, they're about to take that. And that might be it. That might be it. 95%. Oh, Margrave's dead. That, that person that I was like, oh, ha, ha, the whole time. Ah, just assault it. Charge! Yep, we want it for them. Quickly, ransom, ransom. Ten. Three. Yes. Give me three. Come on, give me the money before the war ends. Come on. Cough up the money. Cough it up. Thank you. Quickly, ransom that one as well. Because we're only going to go back to them anyway after the war ends. So I can make a quick buck on this. Make a quick book. Solid. Right, cool. I made 40 gold on that. And the war's over? I didn't even need to raise my entire army. Correct? Your knight summoned ruined my new garb. My courtier, Af... Agnif? Yeah. Storms into the room followed by a weaver. You're overreacting. I'm simply studying the weave of the fabric. It's important for my projects. Ah. Oh no! Yeah, he's gonna put my court thing down a bit, but I can change it in a year anyway, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. I can't run German might. Do we get anything? You gonna give me anything for it? I did technically take a place for you. No, fine. Whatever. We out. But Island, I'm getting a little bit worried about Island maybe taking a crack at us pretty shortly because they're getting pretty big. I think it's Leinster. Could just start eating up Ireland. It would help me taking out England. Or could he? Wales. Hmm. He has a lot of friends. A lot of friends. You're still alive! You're ill. Well, I'll send you a poem. No, I can't do it for another two years. Alright. God, only 10%, even though you're ill. All right, fine. Oh, yeah. There you go. Money, please. F you pay me, Pope boy. Please. Ah, we live in fascination. Your culture is skilled with fascination communal government. A new fascination can now be selected. All right, well, I'm now bankrolled. 
And I can go and choose. I'm in the wrong place, aren't I? There we go. Innovation. We still need to... Okay, so we're 50% of the way to high medieval. What to choose? I guess I'll choose hereditary rule. 17 years. What's royal prerogative? Can act higher crown authority. That wouldn't be too bad. Bailiff's domain limit. 21 years. 41 years. Can act partition law and monthly prestige plus 5%. That's pretty good. Okay. Hereditary rule it is. So the battlements would be pretty decent. 42 years will kill me though. So, no. Right, well I've almost got... I was about to say I've got, almost got as much money to rival this guy, but I really don't. Stop having children at this age! Ah, oh, damn it. How many people could you raise? A wife's touch. Listen well, Samun. My wife must be hurt. Oh, she's going to make it worse, though. Come, darling. Leave it to the experts. So who could he hire? You could hire... Are these all away currently? Oh, no. They just say they put me in debt. Right, okay. So he could hire about 4,000 men, maybe? Maybe a bit more. 5,200. 5,200. He's got what? That 8,000 men. How many men do I have by myself? Like 6,000 men? I have 6,400. Oh, wow. I could found a holy order. There can be never too many warriors de dedicated to defending the true faith. I will honor St. George by giving those who would serve a home in arms. A holy order of your faith will be founded. You become the holy order's patron. That's amazing. You gain founded holy order for five years. What? The, the Pope will love me and the further that we lost from going to the crusade in Syria will be sort of fixed again. You have a barony with a city that can be at least out as a holy order's headquarters. Pope Alexander has zero opinion. He loved devotion is both servant. I mean, who owns Talov and how much money do I make from Talov currently, eh? I assume not much. Never look. Back off for a second. I do make two tax. What's the cheapest city I can give him? 1.23. 1.23. Damn this place for making loads of money. Damn my lands for making so much money. Oh, inspiration realized. In here, my lord. A large, fustian tapestry of very fine craftsmanship. This is lovely. Masterwork. Excellent tapestry. Dynasty opinion. Court grandeur bonus. Well, I mean, I'm going to use it. But it's not as funky fresh as I would have liked. I'm not complaining. Oh, can I not put it up? Have I got too many things on the wall? Oh, really? Well, I can switch that out, I guess. Because that's better. Because that only does Core Grandio plus two, because I'm not part of Count of House Estrid. Whereas that gives me that plus my Dynasty Opinion. Oh, that does look quite nice. Yeah, there's no other place I can put stuff down, I don't think. Small wall ornament. Yeah. Okay, fine. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Right. Cheap place to give him. 1.23. Okay, Vard. The Knights of Vard sounds pretty cool as well, to be fair. So let's go Vard. No, Vard. Let me, let me click Vard. There we go. It's, it's weird that if you click there, it's not technically clicking it. But if you click there, that's where it clicks. Vard. The Holy Order of Vard. Nom nobis domine. Holy Order hired. Knights of Australia have been called by King Ramiro Sanchez of Aragorn. We are sport Grandmaster Valdemar has founded the Knight's Hospitality. Hospitality. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh. I said it right. Cool! Amazing. God, I have gone fully into the faith. You know what I was saying? Choosing the faith or being Danish. Guess I've gone the other way. I assume the Pope loves me, right? Oh, he loves me. I gotta wait two years. But he'll definitely give me money, so that's fine. Can I now, if I go to military and go to holy orders, they're already hired. Do I get anything from these bros for being hired? I don't know if I do. Oh, well, whatever. I made them, which is important. You gonna die yet? Monthly income has finally dropped. He's not losing money, though, by any means. You know what? This has been a very uh, religious-based episode. We've had crusades, we've had holy orders, we've had a bonkers war, which we lost decisively. 
We've got a new nice tapestry. I think things are going pretty well. I'm still alive at 51. It's not too bad. We haven't actually covered a lot of time, though, because a lot of things happen within this space. But that's all fine. Dublin's fixed. The culture is finally done here as well, I believe. Yeah, so we can actually focus on promoting Dublin now. Ten years isn't actually that bad. Honestly, it ain't. Okay, fine. That's good. Which one's... Go fix Blackinger? And you... I suppose you could start fabricating a claim, but... I don't really know where. Norway looks broken. What, who are you at war with? Oh! Don't be a son. No! I'm going to leave Eastland to next time. We've had a lot of religious-based stuff. But it's going pretty well. The Pope loves us. Everyone loves us. We're a crusader. We've got a holy order in our backs now. Everything's generally healthier. Dublin's now being put in their place. They are part of Denmark, if they like it or not. And hopefully the guy of Iceland, Eastland will die soon. But I'm going to leave it there for the time being. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a like. Let me know in the comments if you want to be named, if you want one of the children to be named after yourself. Obviously, it might be the next person now because I'm getting pretty old. I might die soon. And as always, feel free to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when the next episode of this comes out and other series on the channel. Ciao for now, guys.